Yeah, what's up, CMB? Sorry, I was distracted by trying to seal armor off of a thing's body. I am curious... For our lightsabers that we made, do they show up? What do you mean? It, with the lights on? Oh, I see. You know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, like, that was an instance where other potion would be useful. So yeah, we made fancy lightsabers, Yeah, Ronnie. we made- sorry, I just made Ronnie fancy- just keeps this shit changed. She wants to play. We made fancy lightsabers at Disney. It's like metal. I just wanted to see if you could actually- <laughs> You can kinda- you can see it. Yeah, it looks pretty good. It actually well, looks pretty good on, on let, let me turn off the lights really quick. It's making a sound. It's making sounds. <laughs> Wait, get mine out. <laughs> Wait, get mine. <laughs> Here you go. So yeah, we we made the fancy lightsabers, obviously. Making sound effects. <laughs> I like you gave it to me upside down. <laughs> to make everything a hundred times harder. Mine's really. It's just like. Metal, the base is like metal, and you got to put it together yourself while you were there. Yeah, we got to order the mounts. It is kind of like a giant black light. Mine's purple, so. <laughs> Who can guess what color I made? Don't mess with me, I am strong with the force. You are correct. <laughs> You are correct. <laughs> <laughs> so these were $250 each. They were expensive. A giant adult toy. It looks so cool. It's so glowy. I know. <laughs> we gotta hang these up on the wall. We do. Well, that's why- are they battery powered? Oh. <laughs> because like right if we if we um that's very true cmb that is very true but yeah you can see the difference in our healths so mine's like a uh um original trilogy era health and Roundy's is a high republic era health yeah cool though but because like right we could if we if we had um, our stream set up so there's a background right and they're mounted behind us we could turn them on as background stream lights. That's true. That would be awesome. Anyways, Roddy's being a distraction today. Wait, Corey, and did you get to see R92? I'm being a distraction? You're the one that's saying now you want to bring R92 out? Well, I mean, if we're gonna be distracting... I gotta make sure this isn't gonna fall over. Is it because I had it set have you bottom? You gotta put it you gotta put the handle at the bottom because it's so heavy. Well, I mean, when I it has it has to go this way. But yeah, we've got full Star Wars cosplays, so when Fall Jedi Survivor comes out, we're gonna stream and cosplay. Yeah. Alright, and we also built a astromech droid named R92. So I just hit that I button? I think so. <laughs> yep. So, I mean, if you put him on the ground, we can drive him that way and be able to see him. He turns too sharply, I can't get him in frame! <laughs> He's stuck. You smells like, what the heck? There he goes. I heard you were talking shit. <laughs> <laughs> the cats are like, what the heck is that thing? Hello? <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> anyway, we just, we spent a lot of money
Disney and Star Wars world to make a bunch of grown-up toys is basically what happened. <laughs> Alright. Back to uh, serious stuff like Final Fantasy. But yeah, I mean, I'm very excited to like, go find a cool place to take pictures and cosplay. Mm-hmm. Alright. It's your turn. Black Waltz number two. Did my mother really send him to capture me? Cannot be. There's no reason to trust the words of some bandit. He was just another criminal scheming to use the princess for some evil deed. Have I not been careful enough? Your noble upbringing cannot be disguised so easily. That's not true at all. You haven't been watching. Dagger is trying really hard. You're the one with the problem walking around yelling princess everywhere. About the border crossing. I wish we were awake for D&D. But we're like, you start and we're like just starting our day. And well, we're like, it's you're three hours behind us, but we're like in the middle of whatever we were doing. Yeah. Oh, yes. Why don't we hitch a ride on this airship? Sure, Lindblom should not be terribly far by airship. Uh, we also got wands. <laughs> we did We did also get wands, but they're definitely not as cool as the other stuff, for sure, that we got. I mean, won't be too far. Um... But wh why don't we get some rest before we go? Yeah, VB needs it, even if that guy does try to do abduct us. Okay, let's head back to the village. Yeah, will they just attack us? Vivi, you'll be safe with me. Yeah, um, for you it's first thing in the morning. For us it's like 11. I, I think it's at like 11 or noon yeah. or something, yeah. It is kind of interesting though. I always no! wondered if. Get out of here! If a morning D&D uh, &D session would be better, like, mentally. Because I really like when my group would play on, like, a Sunday afternoon. Yeah. Like, that's my ideal time because it's like, you know. Eh, ah, okay. Gotcha. D&D <laughs> scheduling is already a nightmare, a but then trying to nightmare. schedule it across multiple time zones. He's out cold. Sorry. Hmm? I thought they captured it already. Stop calling VB in it. Hey, I know she's cute, but it's rude of you to stare. Only one moment uh, where you would be able to access that treasure chest. Okay. <laughs> Did we miss it? Oh no, I wasn't staring at the young lady. The room is through that door. Stay calm. Has anybody seen if the Legend of the Dragoon port for PS5 is good? Good morning! Good morning! Ray, I'm getting closer to being back to my, uh... uh oh, that's when Dagger is your lead. Okay. I don't... Did we ever have that I don't think time so. yet? Okay, so... Less attack, but we could get Beast Killer. Okay. I guess we'll start working on that. Right? Because we have... Yeah. Yeah, what is up, Ray? Welcome in. Happy Sunday. Okay. Just I just wanted to make sure there was like not like a game breaking glitch or something. Half dudes in Scotland and one in All Vegas. Right, so we don't have bronze helm yet. Man, that sounds like a nightmare to try and schedule stuff. One time I had to schedule a, like a short campaign I ran for a few months and one of the people was in the central time zone and we're on eastern time zone and they were only two hours behind us and it was like still a struggle trying to get them to like show up, you know, at the time that yeah. we would play. Okay, so he can get add stats. Unfortunately, did not have D&D &D today. We have D&D &D on Tuesday, Tuesday, 
with Ian's group where I am uh, one of the players, and then on Wednesday I'm starting my Wild Beyond the Witchlight playthrough where I'm running that campaign. So I still have not been able to play D&D yet. It's been... I have not played D&D since before Christmas at this point. Like, we had one session where we played the first session of the Pathfinder campaign, and then my friend who was running it was like, actually, I don't want to run this. So then we didn't play it, and I was like, no. And my yeah. group just had, like, a few weeks of, like, bad scheduling problems. We've been pretty consistent up until then. Yes, I am going through D&D &D withdrawal right now, which is part of the reason why I'm running a campaign, because I'm like, if nobody's going to run one, I will run it again. Alright, so my question is, should I go fight some random fights like 15 times to finish some levels? Or should Good. I just progress in the plot? Now you have the full party back together. I think I'm gonna progress in the plot. Um, and just see what happens. Okay. Like, I would like to get that stuff, but I'm not- Can you look in the windmill, see if you can get that- The chest up there yet? Oh, no, I guess not, because the windmill's still running. Well, I think I need the key. So you gotta see if the mayor is still in his house. But he is the Don. I tried to go in there and he said the mayor was still in there. Well, it's nice that it doesn't make you walk in and wait for it to load a whole room again. Yeah, yeah. How does one turn off a windmill? Alright, I guess we're getting on the airship. Alright. Well, actually, let's... let's... Okay, let's leave it alone. Never mind. Cause I just I don't know how what else to get in there. Yeah. I love chocobos. Hello, lady. All right. Let's see. The queen's doing something. I, we really don't have a plot yet. Wait here. Well. Wait here while I ask the people inside if we can hitch a ride. I shall go ask them. Oh, really? How come? It, it is not for your benefit. I am only doing this for the princess. Clack, clack, Steiner, clack. he was so adamant about going back to the castle before. An airship full of barrels like the ones I saw at the castle. Steiner was against going. Zidane, this, is this ship really headed for Lindblom? No, it'll probably take us straight to Alexandria Castle. But why? Didn't you just say we should get on the ship? Yeah, I know. Trust me. Zidane? What is it, Vivi? Those dolls they were making underground? Do you think they look like me? I'm gonna boost his confidence. Okay. Not really. They're just dolls, baby. It's dolls. moving. The heck is Steiner up to? Alright, we have to get on Dagger. Oh! On a ship that's not going to Limblum? I don't have time to explain. Is this where we meet Sid? Yeah, who's Sid in this game? This way. Hurry up! We have nothing to worry about. Hurry before she takes off! But... I'll take you to Lindblom, I promise. I'm- I'm giving this baby attention. Fine, I'll get on. We're working right now. We're entertaining the people. I'm entertaining this cat. Did he- he pushed up on her butt and I, said, ooh, <laughs> soft. I think he did. <laughs> you pervert! Also, my shirt has a uh, little Aladdin's lamps on it because I- uh, Aladdin was my favorite movie until probably The Princess and the Frog. Is Aladdin your favorite prince? It's between Aladdin and Naveen. Come on, it's not like I did it on purpose. Please, enough. There's the royal tone in your voice again. Are you okay, Vivi? 
feels like I'm gonna get sucked into the sky. Let's go inside, Vivi. What if she grabbed our butt? As payback? Yep. It's only fair. I trust you, Zidane. I get the feeling she doesn't quite trust me yet. Maybe she'll reward me with a kiss or two if I try hard enough. <laughs> Zidane! Wow, already? Zidane! What is it? Something wrong? It's Vivi. Vivi? Um... Wow, they're alive and they're moving around. Hello? So the mages built in the village bring back the new ones. Oh, oh Vivi. Oh, that's you. Vivi? Um... Vivi! Look at him follow you around. Yeah. Swole Vivi. Uh-huh. Were you able to talk to any of them? No. It's like... They don't even... See me at all. I tried... Again and again, but they won't even turn around. Vivi. I need to go upstairs for a little bit. I gotta turn the ship around before it reaches the castle. Keep an eye on Vivi, okay? Looks like a treasure chest, but it's actually part of the ship. Wow. They had to put that in there because too many people probably thought. Yeah. Who's behind all of this? Can you pass me a high chew? Guard chew? Yeah. Like the One Piece? Yeah. Yo! CMB! In One Piece, I just got to the. We got to the first time Luffy punches uh, Kaido. We'll be flying over evil forest soon. Did the boss and the others escape safely? I'm sure the boss would tell me that's none of my business. How could this happen? Ascendancy. What am I to do? I never expected things to go so badly. I cannot believe the ship took off without the princess. What will I say to Queen, Queen Braun? What the heck were you doing? You almost took off without us. That is because the ship's crew... Why, you... Where is the princess? In the engine room. She's on the ship? All is well now. The ship is returning to the castle. You will be hanged for the kidnapping of a member of the royal family. Enjoy your freedom while you can. This <laughs> like, shut the hell up. I will not let you near the princess. Also, um, the, uh, Team Behind Dark is adapting Something is Killing to Children. That'd be great. Yeah, is it kidnapping if she self-kidnaps? But I guess, like, the queen might not believe, you know. Yeah, like, it's I, not really kidnapping, but... It's like he doesn't even see me. At last, Queen Braun is sure to be pleased. However, the princess would have been left behind without the thief's aid. <laughs> oh, you mean away <laughs> from the castle. That's basically how it went. I, that might be the actual dialogue, for all I know. <laughs> I shall petition for a life sentence on his behalf. Yes, that would be the honorable thing. But that was because the crew wouldn't listen. I must run a background check on them. Ah, uh, yes, it is my this duty is, as a knight. This is like the interaction between Rogue and Paladin in D&D. Yeah, I mean, that's literally what they are. Black Waltz number three. Ooh. They do look pretty cool. Do -do -do. 
It's like, what the hell? Yeah, yeah. What's wrong? Something stuck in your throat? You insolent fool! Turn the ship around! Gah! <laughs> I will have your head for that. Oh yeah, I forgot. He's a monkey, not a cat. Yep. Hey, I think we upset them. But they didn't respond to anything until now. You're the one who started this trouble. And make it double. I apologize. Please wait while I take this fool into custody and turn the ship around. What? What's wrong? Yo, tsunami. Yo. Oh. Oh no. No. Phoebe, are you okay? So number two is defeated by a small child. You are no match against I my I like the power. idea of the other ones being like super cool. Huh? And this one's like, so number two is defeated by a small child. You are no match against my power. You want to read for this one in the Whoa. Mickey voice? Oh. Cool. <laughs> Princess, see that while I eliminate this child. It's like Pico or whatever his name is in One Piece. Are you protecting him? Oh, the squad's here. Nonsense, you are no different from mindless dolls. What can you do? Get out of my way. Do you dare to fight a black waltz? I said, get out of my way. Oh man, we keep crashing airships. Yeah, this is like the second or third time. Oh Why no! Why does this cutscene feel more high def than the other ones? Phoebe! <laughs> what is happening? Phoebe's the Preston Digitator. Oh no. Phoebe's like my family! I made up this. Well, it's a word. It's a spell in D&D at least. True. Cruelty! This is why ah! our family die. <laughs> Master BB, I shall assist you. Hey, you got oh dagger. Yeah, yes. We'll take care of the black walls. You steer the ship. Things are gonna get even more dangerous from here on. It's not too late to turn back. You can go back to the castle across Southgate and the Lindblum. It's your choice. I'll be with you either way, but try not to crash the ship. Bye. Now we get a save point. Be careful, Z Zidane. Why? Is a hat. Why would you do such a thing? Weren't they your friends? Okay. Gotta make sure to steal. We got the steal from number two you as well. You fool! Do I look like some lowly black mage to you? Even if you weren't your allies, what you did was reprehensible. <laughs> Worry not about them. Many more are being produced even now. What are you? Ah, the princess's bodyguards have gathered. How very convenient. Answer me. It wouldn't do you any good if I answered, since you're all going to die. <laughs> I will eliminate any who stand in my way. Alright. I'm also working on the bandit skill now, so that way we'll get better the steals rate right higher. I'm nailing that villain laugh. I just gotta, you know, I always say whenever Ian and I watch One Piece that all the characters have really distinct laughs, and I feel like that should be incorporated into like D&D and other stuff more. It's like everybody has just a really weird laugh, right? Three different items. One of them is something we already had. They're not good seals, but free items are free items. Yeah, we got one of them so far. Yeah, every character has like a very distinctive laugh in One Piece, and I'm just like, how do they keep coming up with different ways to laugh weird? Like, they just keep making up all these weird laughs. Missed that one. Oh 
Yoda too good. I should start pre-coming up with laughs for the big uh, villains in my the D and D campaign. Yeah. Like each one will have a different one. He's just two stepping on his enemies. Come on! Yeah! But, gotta get the items. Okay, we got a linen cuirass. One more. Too, so like I'm obviously like I'm not gonna kill it that fast probably nope. oh no movement of the ship to attack. <laughs> I mean, you probably wouldn't hit, kill him within the first few hits. So yeah. You could probably have some people attack. Just get him close to death, at least. I like this one's huge fur or feather collar. It's a look. It is a look. <laughs> He, do it. he started to fly when I hit him. I don't think anybody else can hit him now, maybe? Oh. Okay, that wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Yeah, I think only BB can hit him now. You think you can, can defeat, defeat me? me? I don't know if I can seal while he's flying. Whoa! BB coming out with the heavy hits. I think while you're doing this fight, I'm gonna feed the cats. Good idea. In the air, he has stronger magic and AoE. trying to steal, but we'll see. Also, it's making me a little motion sick because of the freaking rocking. Not really motion sick, but it's annoying me.
like, what is my percentage of the chance to steal this thing? Because I still have it. 10% or less. It's a viable item, so, like he said. You, you scum. I exist only to kill. And that's why I slay. Just how many black waltzes do we have to fight? This is becoming ridiculous. I think that was the last one. Based on the name Waltz. <laughs> how do you know? Are you? He said waltz, right? Don't you think number three would be the last one? I can see Southgate. She's gonna go for it. Yeah, it, I mean, it is kind of easy to miss if you're not paying attention. Brownie, it's our people. Did you see that? That I did see. Our enhanced black mages, our black mage enhancements. All defeated. Betrayed us, Steiner did. It's all his fault. Huh? Man, I do not like the way he's looking at the camera. It's like when you see an like an eagle from straight on, they look so derpy. This, thing's, this is nightmare material. Unstable the ship becomes. Don't let go of the steering wheel. Number three is coming back! True, is it? Hooray! But something is wrong. It's broken! Made its magic too powerful, we did. There's nothing we can do now. The we shall depart! Run, Run away! away! What? <laughs> oh, okay. I exist only to kill. 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 Yeah, away we run. Do you see th Do you see Southgate? Yes. The English soccer manager? Southgate is a huge gate built exclusively for airships, but maneuvering through it could be tricky. Do you want me to do it, Dagger? I want to do it on my own. Alright. I've never flown a ship before, but I think I can do it. We don't have clearance. They might close the gate on us. Yeah, they don't do it all the time. Like, sometimes they just yell things. It should be okay, though. Security was totally lax when I came through here on the theater ship. It'll be fine, Captain Dagger. Roger. Old Roger? It's old, but the engine's got power. We must turn back. Princess, please turn the ship around. The Black Waltz is heading straight toward us on an airship. He might crash into us. Dagger, Rusty's right. is heading straight for us. Punch it. Go through Southgate. Don't be ridiculous. What if the gate closes on us? There's no way we can outmaneuver him in this cargo ship. We'll slide in before the gate closes and shut him out. That's our only chance. Rusty, turn the power up to max with that lever over there. Dagger, stay on course, no matter what. Okay. I know we can make it. With the power of my belief in my friends... Yo, Smokey. Perfect. Oh, what the... They're just in time for a dramatic cutscene. Vivi is looking sad. He just did see, have... like, eight of his clone brothers murdered. Yeah. Still 
coming, huh? Oh, no. Are we supposed to- we're supposed to go in here? Oh, okay. BB's got the itis. <laughs> Why can't we just fly over it? I think because we're, like, technically entering another country's airspace. They set their own ship on fire? It's convenient for us. Yeah, I don't know why, but the cutscenes look less blurry today for some reason. To me. Well, not every cutscene. Like, those ones are definitely more high def. There are some cutscenes that are, like, kind of in the engine, and then some that are, like, definitely mm. videos. But yeah, what's up, Smokey? Are you flying? Skirt. Where are we going? Oh, I guess we're going here. We're going to Lindblum. I think we pushed it a little too hard. Good mods for Hogwarts. <laughs> I've seen people with the mods, they're so funny. What is- is it like clothing ones or like, like- No, I saw one where it was like- they were like, Dobby has a Glock! And oh. I like- <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Well, I saw silent people. We made it, come on, cheer up. Southgate was badly damaged. It was my fault, wasn't it? Did you make coffee? No coffee. Don't worry about it, they're fixing up in no time. Mickey has a gun. <laughs> <laughs> you idiot! The cargo ship was wrecked, we lost all the cargo, and Southgate was destroyed! Why is there, like, reggae music playing? I can't believe I played a part in this debacle! Oh, yeah, yeah. Steiner. I, there's a lot of good character customization in it. Yes, princess. I didn't mean to get you involved, but you saved us. I thank you. Such kind words. I am not worthy. Such a simp. <laughs> he really is a simp. <laughs> well, now I've made up my mind. I vow to protect you, princess, until we return to the castle. How do you feel about that dagger? Help oh, it's, it's sorry me. to you, sorry. How do you feel about that dagger? He'll follow you to the end of the world. It's okay, Zidane. Hey, I can see the main gate of Limblum. That's Limblum Cla- Blah blah blah, Limblum Lum Castle? How gigantic. Just like that cake on what's his name earlier in the game. The city of Limblum is inside the castle. I guess Dagger and I will go our separate ways once we reach Limblum. They better, put the whole city in the castle? Better kiss her now. I see. Well, I mean, but like, if you think of older castles, they have like the the three areas, right? There was like the central, yeah, gate, then that, then that. So I guess technically you would all be. I guess. Cause like the castle is the walls. I see. Just when we were beginning to get close. Phoebe, Zidane, Zidane. Those black mages and I. Are we? The same? I don't understand, Master Vivi. Just what seems to be the problem. I don't know. Master Vivi, why would those mages be the same as you? And why would it matter if they were? Rusty's right. <laughs> All black mages look alike. <laughs> We can Duh, clearly... you can't just say that. Yeah. But Vivi, Vivi's got more drip than them, so he's 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 easy to find. <laughs> <laughs> You're an individual, no matter what happens, Vivi. Right. Let's go out to the deck. Why? You've got to see Lindblom from above. It's the best. Look, the Falcon's Gate is right in front of us. Another cutscene! He respects him too much <laughs> to be like, he does seem like somebody that would, yeah. I hope 
hope Steiner has a good character arc because right now he's just kind of annoying. He's just a dweeb hanging out with the, the cool people. Yeah. It is a cool looking city. It reminds me of like a uh, Minas Tirith or something. Yeah, yeah. Linda Blum Grand Castle. Wow, this castle is huge. It's even bigger than Alexandria. Yeah, they don't call it Lindblom Grand Castle for nothing. An indoor airship dock? This is truly amazing. Even Her Majesty's red robes would easily fit in here. Dagger, you don't look too impressed. Have you been here before? Yes, I came here a few times when I was little. I haven't been here since my fa father passed away. Here comes the welcoming committee. Oh no, they've got Pope hats. That's a really old airship. Greetings, I am Princess Garnet Till Alexandros. You gotta play it. <laughs> it's a rule. I humbly request an audience with Regent Sid. Sid! Sid, 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 Sid. You must be kidding. No member of the royal family, let alone a princess, would ever ride in such a shabby airship. Hello, Mr. Pythons. Yes, hello. Oh, look at that cute Moogle hello, emote. Hello, Moogle emote. Hello. Got some Moogle mail uh, to Luna, deliver. Luna's trying to get up. Oh, there we go. I like that one. Oh, that is really cute. The little mage one. Oh, and here's, here's our kitty. Yes, welcome. Welcome to our playthrough of Final Fantasy IX. Yeah, this is our first playthrough. And look at the company you're keeping. Accused the princess of lying. The princess was forced to come here under extreme circumstances. So I'm assuming, Meester, that you are a big Nine fan. This is. We've played a lot of Final Fantasies. This is our first time playing Nine, though. We've never played this one before. Yeah. Then show me some kind of proof of your royal heritage. Very well. Eight is your fame. Okay, eight. Eight is tied with 12 for second for me. I'm a seven boy. I, I have 10 is my favorite, but I haven't played it in a really long time, so I want to replay it to see if I still like it. Yeah, that's on our list to replay, but there's a lot of new yeah. games coming out soon. Yeah. So this might be the last Final Fantasy we've for, for a while. For a little bit, yeah. Until it's 16. good so far. This pendant, is it the Falcon Claw? No, the shape is a little different. Call Minister Artania. Ted's ending is It's so brutal. Yeah, it is very tear inducing. If you weren't such a filthy looking oaf, they would not be so suspicious of us. He's now so let me ask, what did you think of 15? Because like I think 15's presentation story-wise is very bad. The game is very fun, and when you watch all the extended stuff, you play the DLC, you read the book, it's a really beautiful story. It's just not pulled coherently. Yeah. Hey, I'm not the idiot with the loud voice and the dirty, rusty armor. What? What? What is going on? Sir, we have unknown oh, visitors who want, wish to see the region. I was watching chat. <laughs> yeah. And one of them is carrying a pendant that looks like a falcon claw. You are dismissed. I'll take care of this. Yes, sir. Uncle Artania! A gang of squalls. You are kind of right. Um, Prompto was maybe the only one who varied from that, but then Prompto has that weird clone arc. Yeah, but I feel like they don't really go over his arc until you do, like, the DLC, the DLC or anything. I'm gonna really quick. Okay. We, I will leave Ronnie to uh, entertain you. I'm in the process of peeling off my, <laughs> my, my gel nails or my... I went and got my nails done with my sister for her birthday, which was like three weeks ago, and the color was still on, and I'm trying to get them off. Jesse Raspberry stole your heart in the seven. Oh, Jesse Raspberry took your heart in the seven remake. Yeah, 
The, the 7 remake is really good. I've never played the original 7, although Ian has. It's his favorite of the Final Fantasy games. But I'm thoroughly enjoying the remake, and I'm definitely a very big Tifa Lockhart fan. Um, all the way. Tifa all the way. But I think the 7 remake is beautiful. Like, it looks so beautiful. And we just replayed Crisis Core because uh, Ian really... He remembered liking that one because of the extra story elements it gives to the main story of Seven. And it was interesting. I wonder if we'll see those characters show up again in the new story. What? Uh, in, like, the Seven remake. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, I mean, they were already, like... They didn't have a lot of uh, development in the original Seven, but you still were like, those were my friends. Yeah. And then in this one, they were like, now we love them. <laughs> now you love them. Alright. Uncle Artania. It's good to see you, princess. Please follow me, the regent is waiting. We do have some, uh... Oh, I forgot to make us... Thank you for the follow. Yes, thank you. Get a little gizmo emote there. See what's going on in Lindblom. But yes, thank you for the follow. Be You're cool, welcome. everybody. We are obviously Final Fantasy fans. We mostly play RPGs. Oh, look at the pink chocobo with the little flower. It's cute. Wait, wait, You're going to see the Regent? Wow, you're so lucky. The last time I saw him was over a half a year ago when I was promoted to officer. He's a very busy man. I'm taking the day off. He has a name. He does have a name. How would you say that? Uma, Uma Ida? Umeida. Umeida. Alright, yeah, get some sleep. Um, yeah. I'm assuming you're in the UK then. I love the oh my god at the beginning, like, oh my god, it's past one. I did not even realize. Yeah. <laughs> That's been me. Thanks for the for follow. Sure. Go get some rest. Why don't you relax a bit and listen to my story? I will listen to the story. Come on, you'll love it. This is your only chance to hear it. Here it goes. When I was 27. <laughs> when I was a young boy, my father took me into Jeez. the city to pet a chocobo. He said, son, when you grow up. I was trying to think of a Final Fantasy themed thing I could say. Oh. 20 years of rule under Sid the Ninth. I like how in some games Sid is a regent and in other games Sid's a mechanic. Yeah. Like, it's like... Looks like there's no place to insert the metal. He's like Barbie. He does it all. Welcome to Lindblom. Alright, do we want to go upstairs or do we want to go this way? Um, I don't, I'm assuming the regent is between those two guys. Oh, probably. I was like, he'd be upstairs because he's more important, but there are guards there, you're right. Item? Yes. Can I have another haichu? I got the sense you didn't really love these, so... They are fine, but they are much less flavorful than the Starburst. They are. I think that's because Asian candies in general have less sugar in yeah, them, Yeah, yeah, so... I was gonna say, it's healthier. No. Look at this cute little outfit! Valor Scout. Can we get you this outfit? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Big and Wedge are immortal. Yeah. Yep. You're an airman, right? Seems like a lot of girls are joining the crew these days. Oh, hello. So what are you doing here? Should you be at the airship docks or something? the flight test for the new model. I was really looking forward to flying number one, but it's gone now. Who knows when they'll finish number two at the region's current condition. Don't worry, you'll get your chance someday, and you'll be the first pilot ever to fly a new model. By the way, what's your name? Thank you, I feel much better now. Good, I'm Zidane, and you're... My name is Aaron. 
Hey, that's a really nice name, Aaron. I'm gonna go get something to eat now. Do you wanna... I have to get back now. Goodbye. Rejected. Yeah. Rejected! Me. Trying to flirt with Ronnie originally. Excuse me? It was the opposite! Don't you dare try to make it seem like it was me. Alright, let's see what's through here. Oh, chests. Oh, there, oh, there's two, two chests. chests. Take a nice little nap in this fancy Glass bed. armlet. Oh yeah, let's look at... The stuff you stole? So we're working on ad status. And Blizzard. I do think if we get to a spot where there's enemies, we should just do nine battles. Yeah. And get that. Working on Bandit. Steel Jill and Antibody. We have Beast Killer. So this lowers our spirit. Only by one, though. And yeah. your evade and your magic evasion goes up. We get Steel Jill and Antibody or Flea Jill. That time of the game? What does that mean? What, where we equip a bunch of different stuff to try and learn abilities? Um, yeah, so this one has two we can learn, so let's put that on. Chakra. But we we can't learn anything there, can't so. Can't learn it, yeah. Not spoiling. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. This does give us better defense, so I'm gonna put it on. Aww. Well, can someone else learn Chakra yet? So you're learning, Beast Killer. We're doing less damage with Stanley right now, but I want to get his boost. Mm -hmm. Learn. We're almost for Bug Killer. Oh, that'll be good. And we already have Bird Killer, so let's put that on. And then we gotta go to Ability. You're liking the XFL? Oh, games? the XFL. Yeah, I've seen that they're pretty pretty dramatic recently from what I've seen. It seems like they're growing in popularity. Well, yeah, because like, you know, that was the issue with football for people. It's like hockey and soccer and stuff go so long. Yeah. Football has like a four month, five month off season. Yeah. I haven't watched any. The, I guess the team we would support would be the DC Defenders, because they're the closest to Buffalo. Alright, so we got stuff going. Wait. Why does Steiner have zero... Is it because he has zero points available, or did I accidentally unequip everything? He has zero points available, right? Yeah. Okay, okay. I wanted to make sure it didn't mean that I had zero of I had 19 uh, points available. Oh. Hold on. Ether. Oh, yeah, there you go. It's a letter from Kumop Koopo Koopo. Thank you very much, Koopo Koopo. Stillskin visited me, Koopo. He said he found a place that seemed interesting and then he left. Oh, she stayed longer, Koopo. Where did he go anyway? Let me know when you find out, Koopo. Stillskin, Stillskin, Koopo, Koopo. I wonder if he stopped in Lindblum. I do gotta say, the pacing of this is so far pretty good. Mm -hmm. Like, you can explore, but like, it's not like, you know, you get like over inundated. You can go for one, two, or three points. How do you get three points in the XFL? Interesting. Man, gel nails really F up your fingernails. This is why I don't get my nails done ever. Yeah. Alright. So that was upstairs. We didn't go this way. Is this 
standing in the elevator waiting for us this whole time. Sorry, we had to loot your chambers. Lindblom Castle has three levels, all connected by this lift. From the base level, which lies below the mist, you can take a trolley to the harbor and the back gate. Ships hardly arrive at the harbor anymore, so travel by air has become so popular. The mist possesses great danger, so we've sealed off everything. Just above the base level is the mid-level. You can ride the air cab from the mid-level to go to town. The upper level contains the royal chamber and conference room. Access to that level is restricted because the regent himself resides there. Hey, Dagger? What's Regent Sid like? I lived in Lindblom for a while, but I've never met him. Regent Sid is very wise. He always thinks ahead. He may seem a bit odd at times, but he is very dependable. He and my father were best friends. I wonder if he will even listen to what I have to say. Don't worry, we're not leaving until he does. We will arrive at the upper level shortly. Why does she have to keep calling herself Dagger if everybody knows who she is now? She's claiming her own identity. Sire, Princess Garden of Alexandria wishes to see you. Princess, is something wrong? The Regent isn't here and I don't know who... Take a look at the throne. What in the world? Bok Bok? Bok Bok? Greetings! Og? Og? Oglog? Oglog? Oh, you punched him. The little bug. Sire! What? What? Dagger, what's wrong? Why aren't you talking to? Jeez, that's an Oglop! Wow, even the Oglops are big in Lindblum. What is the meaning of this? the princess like this. Get that repulsive bug off the throat immediately and call the regent. I mean, it wouldn't be hard. You probably could just use, like, RPG Maker. <laughs> Please settle down. You are before the regent. What? Enough of your nonsense. Steiner, stand down. I remember that mustache. Is that really you, Uncle Sid? What if I could get my mustache to be that dramatic? I think you'd have to grow it out a lot more. Well, obviously, his mustache is like shaped like. It have to come out to like here. You know? This is this is white beard. <laughs> or like up to here. Yeah. Yes, greetings, oh, uh, huh? Looking like Wario. I am Sid from the region of Wario. Wario. I knew it was you. I recognized your pendant's description. It's so much like my falcon claw. I'm delighted to see you again, Garnet. You have truly quack, become a fine lady. I, on the other hand... With a guac guac 9000. Allow me to explain. About six months ago, someone snuck into the castle and attacked the regent in his sleep. Unfortunately, we are too late. The regent had been transformed into an oglop, and his wife, Lady Hilda, was abducted. My goodness. Whoever pulled this off had to be highly skilled, like me. Hmm, I'll bet it was you. That is not possible. I killed them. <laughs> How can you be so sure? Do you know who we are? Of course, I may be a bug, Quack, but I'm still the ruler of Limblum. Uncle Sid, I appreciate you seeing me on such short notice. I desperately need to speak with you, to you about my mother. That's what I figured. But I'm sure it can wait till tomorrow. Why don't you all get some rest for today? Thank you. It is time for lunch. Please follow me. Lunch. Time for the royal lunch. I can't stand the food at the castle. It's way too high class for my taste. How can anyone get full of that stuff? So it's basically the kids at Destiny who are like, I want McDonald's. Mm -hmm. The cheap food here is a lot better. Today's special is Soup de Silence. Not bad. So we do, right now we're doing Sunday, Monday, or Final Fantasy IX, and then Thursday, 
Saturday is Dragon, Dragon Age, Age One Origins. Yeah. yeah. Um, but we are not super close to the end, but I think we're moving into the final act of Dragon Age soon. Yeah. So and then we're um gonna play Dragon Age Two. Dragon Age Two. And I can't decide if next I want to play Legend of the Dragoon or Digimon New Next Order. Yeah. Um, but we're basically waiting until Jedi Survivor and Final Fantasy 16 come out. Yeah, um, Jedi Survivor is going to be cool. And Jedi Survivor will be done in full cosplay. <laughs> Yo, Pops, I'll have the stupid special. Who said that? Bobo? Who said that? Zidane, I figured it was you. How have you been? Alright, I guess. Look at this lady looking at us. Yeah, right? Have a seat, your soup will be ready in a minute. So Legend of the Dragoon is another game from this era also, like it looks like this, but it's got one of the best stories. I feel like she'd have a very sultry voice. She'd yeah. be like, do you mind? You're standing in everyone's way. Wow. Look at her huge, chunky sandals. She's got yeah, very uh, hey. Zoomer vibes. <laughs> yeah? Do you want a drink? Next order on PS4. Ten. Brother paid 10 on PS4 and 60 on Switch. Yeah, yeah we'll probably just get it on Steam. Yeah. I, I already read it. How about you and me go for a cruise on an airship? Really? An airship? Sounds like you've never been on one. You know Lindblum is quite a sight high above. Hey, Monkey Tail, you're disturbing the other customers. I was like, that's gotta be a player character, right? What the? You've got a tail too, rat face. So, uh, like, how- Rat face? How is Next Order? Because I want to play it. After I finish my drink, I'm gonna kick your butt. Is it like, you think it would be a good stream game? Hey, Zidane, take it outside. Get the chat bubble shaking. Yeah. Long time, Zidane. Hey, what's up? Wait a minute. You forgot my name? No, I remember. You're Helga, right? Wrong. Christine? No! Are, is it a Dane basically oh, yeah. Captain Jack Sparrow? You used to live next door to me. How's it going? Ratchel? Ratchel. Man, you've really gotten <laughs> big. You nasty little... Come on, I'm just kidding. You know I never forget a pretty girl's name. Freya? Why right. is her art her walking around like a rat? Yeah, why? Also, she's in the rain on the ground. We get her dominant hand. She's Burmesian female, age 21. Yeah. So, so how you been, oh, Freya? You, yeah. Same old Zidane. How long has it been? About three years. Hey, did you ever find out anything about your boyfriend? No. So, what brings you to Lindblum? The Festival of the Hunt. Is she a Bloodborne character? She kind yeah. of Bloodborne. <laughs> what else? It's a good opportunity to test my skills. Oh. Well, I'm sure you'll find them someday. Aren't you participating? Nah, I think I'll pass. Lazy bum. Are you ever gonna go back? I have no reason to return to Burmesia. There's nothing there for me anymore. Hey. She seems cool. Yeah, you join the party? Clearly she is, because we got to give her a name. 